Good morning. I just woke up. Today is the day that I finally go back to school, which I am nervous about because I've been off for so long and I've just been enjoying my time off and now I don't want to go back. But Merlot is really cute. You're so cute, puppy. Today's the day I leave you. I have to go back to school. At least one of my classes is canceled. So I was supposed to have a class at 12 to 1. That one is now canceled. So I only have class from 2 to 4, which is like nothing. <laughs> so I, it's not really a real day back at school then. I don't know, it just marks my first day back at school. It's really weird. I start on a Friday, but my Monday, I have class from 8 a.m. till uh, 6 p.m. So my Mondays are going to be deadly. I have serious morning voice and I'm not even that hungry yet, but I have to eat breakfast. I wanted to wake up at 8.30, but I slept until 10 because I've just been tired lately. Like, well, not even, I think it's the opposite because I've like been off and like relaxing. I haven't been as tired at night. So it took me a long time to fall asleep last night and then gonna wake up this morning. So I'm now making my favorite breakfast of the moment. So I have some toast in the toaster oven here. And this is my, oh. and this is my favorite bread of the moment. It is the Country Harvest flaxseed and quinoa bread, which I really love. And I have an egg cooking. So I'm just gonna put the top on that so that it cooks sunny side up. And I have an avocado here that kind of turned a little bit brown on the top of it, but I used the other half yesterday and I find that if you keep the seed in it, it doesn't turn as brown because it's not that it's bad, it just oxidizes and they turn really brown. And then I have one other avocado here too. Also how I've been liking my coffee recently is I take a little bit of Nesquik powder and I just sprinkle it in my coffee like that and stir it with my straw. <laughs> And then I pour in a little bit of milk. Oh, too much. And that's how I take my coffee. It's been so good. I normally don't even put sugar or anything in my coffee. Like, if I wasn't putting chocolate powder in it, I would just put milk. But I've been obsessed with chocolate powder in my coffee and it tastes so good. And this is my finished breakfast and what I've been obsessed with lately. So I just take this piece and sandwich it here and then cut it in half and the yolk oozes out, it's so good. So I just finished filming the intro and like voiceover part um, for a video that I'm going to be posting on Saturday. So I'm really excited for that. I'm like five minutes behind schedule for leaving for school, but I kind of gave myself a little bit extra time than I really needed anyways. So I'm just gonna finish getting changed because I just wore this shirt for the video and then um, I'm gonna grab my stuff and head out the door. So I'm on my way to school now and I always get like these little jitters whenever I start back at school. Like I'm nervous to start back. I enjoyed my month long break and I don't want to go back yet. <laughs> I always like get jitters that I won't find my class okay and that, I don't know. Like it's just I guess the start of a new routine so it just feels weird and I don't know if I'm ready. But thank God I only have one class today. I'm really grateful that my first class was canceled because I would have a lot more jitters if I had to do two classes today. I don't know why, like, I guess it's just, it just feels better that it's like a slow start back into school. And usually the first class, they just go over the course outline and stuff anyways, but, you know, just a little nervous. Come here. Can I get your autograph, ma'am? Are you famous? <laughs> Are you from YouTube? Mikey, I have a surprise for you. Flowers? The one with tissue in it. What is it? Yes. Cock. No. Look at the bag. Chocolate. No. Ooh, English breakfast. Your favorite. So Michael and I are back in the car. I left for school and my class is really great. I really like my professor. Mm -hmm. And I think this class is going to be like pretty cool, pretty interesting. It's called Sociology of Food and Eating because I have to take like these liberal classes and this is my second last one and then I'm done. So um, I was done around four and then Mike was gonna be done a little bit later. So instead of him taking the bus home, I was like, I'll wait for you. And then I went to Tivana at Yorkdale because I've been obsessed with peach tranquility tea. 
lately. So um, they actually didn't have it because I bought it about two weeks ago and I drank it all. So I wanted to like, when I say obsessed, like obsessed, I've been obsessed with it. So I decided to go back and get more, but they didn't have it and this, the um, girl helping me out, Grace, she was really helpful, I really, really liked her. Um, and she recommended, what's it called? Okay, first of all, I bought this like tea thingy, oh, the container. Oh, so it explodes everywhere. I know, no, there's like a plastic cap on top. Oh, okay. I'm just gonna take off my gloves. Um, it's like airtight, so it's really hard to open. Ooh. Oh, that cap. Uh, precious white peach. So it's a white tea, which has caffeine in it, she told me, as opposed to Peach Tranquility doesn't, but it tastes the same. And I'm really excited to try it. Michael's a little bit sick, but do you well, smell it? That. It smells the same to me. And she said it has caffeine, so it's it perfect. It smells pretty similar, yeah. Mm -hmm. Because um, I've been drinking Peach Tranquility as like an afternoon tea over the break. Like I've been obsessed with it. Like I need to have one every afternoon, and then sometimes I'd have another one before I go to bed. So this one wouldn't be good for uh, before bed, but it would be good for in the afternoon. So I'm really excited. I got this, and she recommended that I get the the um, the container. I feel like these are just like an add-on, like sales thing that they just make you buy. Yeah, you need it but she thing. said that. But she, I don't know. She had my trust, and she said that it keeps the tea a lot fresher, which whatever. And um, it was 75% off, so it was like four dollars. So uh, I got I like, it. It looks cool with the black and white stripes, like a zebra. Yeah. And I was like, I'll just get one. That way, like, every time I need to get tea, I'll just keep putting it in here. And then when I was there, I got Michael, as you saw in the video. What a great girlfriend. She got me a gift. I got him tea bags because he doesn't have any because I have them at my house. And then I got him English breakfast, which is his favorite tea if you watch Vlogmas. Because he helped me out and did me a big favor yesterday. So, I felt like a generous girlfriend. Wanted to show you that I love you. Oh, you're so sweet. <laughs> so anyways, we are gonna go home now. Everyone's coming over to my house for dinner. Everyone meaning my family's gonna be home and my brother's girlfriend. And Mike's supposed to come, but he's not feeling good, so he's not gonna come. I need to rest. But we're ordering food. My family never oh. orders food for dinner. We always I know. cook. I'm sad that I'm actually missing out. <laughs> like, I, I'm terribly sad. But he's not feeling good. Because my brother, the reason why everyone's over is because my brother passed his two exams. Oh, he took three exams so far, and he's passed all of them for his CPA designation. So, big congrats to him. So, we're having, we're ordering dinner tonight. <laughs> And, um, Congrats, Mark, if you watch this. He won't, but... Oh. This is Rachel singing and driving. In traffic, we're literally going 25 kilometers. 25. 15, no, 15. 15. 11. 10. It's, it's been like, I don't know, how long? Um, since 5.53. It's been, yeah. Half an, hour. half an hour it could have been home in like 20 minutes but no and we're like not even half well, we're probably halfway we're halfway home yeah <laughs> we'll be home in an hour uh, uh. No, i think it'll get better from here do you think i didn't want anyone thinking i still care i don't but phone selfie it's so dark you probably can't see it. i know i probably don't have a face I just learned, like, it took me a week after hearing this song, like, consist consistently for a week. Then I realized that the song, because it's called Love Yourself, I thought it meant, like, love yourself, like, self-love, you know, like, self-empowerment. Meanwhile, he's talking about, like, go love yourself. Like, I, I can't love you, you go love yourself, like. Oh, this song? You were telling me about this song. Yeah, he's pretty much saying like F off, like Get out of my life. Play on words, I think. Oh. I didn't understand <laughs> until I listened to it like for a while. Because I watched the music video too and I'm like, I don't get it, like it doesn't really make sense. And then now that I understood, it makes sense. Is this JB? Yeah. So I'm back upstairs now. I took a little, not really like a nap, I didn't actually fall asleep, but I was I ate dinner with my family, I hung out, 
And then we all just like watched TV and we kind of fell asleep and then my brother went upstairs So I was like, okay, I'm gonna go upstairs and get some work done just because I'm trying to put myself on a more strict schedule for uploading uh, this year and I feel like I've been doing pretty good so far. I have been working on a lot of stuff because I had a month off of school. So I tried to like, not pre-film, but just like get some things started so that I have things to upload and I can be more consistent with my channel because I have a lot of goals for it this year. Uh, my eyes are like kind of watery because I was laying down and my makeup is probably all smudged, but we're just going to ignore that but I really like the lighting on this clip here. Whoa, the camera is like not making it look good. I guess because I'm like filming a screen, but you should check out this video. I'll have it linked below if it's already up, but it should be. So I'll update you if anything exciting happens. So that noise that you hear is the fan on my laptop. I I want to get a new laptop, but I'm like indecisive because I want a desktop because that would obviously be better for editing, but I need a laptop for school. And the simple solution would just be get a desktop and then just use my laptop for school. But the thing is, my laptop is just slow in general. Like I want to get a new laptop, so I'm like indecisive and I don't know what to do, so I'm just not doing anything about it. <laughs> Even though my laptop is slow and it the fan always comes on because it's working too hard, but whatever. <laughs> Leave your comments below on suggestions for new computers. I really like Mac computers, especially for like editing and stuff for what I do with my computer. I prefer Mac, so leave me a comment below on what you think I should do. Because a laptop is just more convenient, but I don't feel like it's pow like powerful enough for what I need it for, and also I'm going to be graduating university in like a year and a bit, so I I don't know if I should get a new laptop because I'm only going to use it for a little bit. You know what I mean? I don't know. I don't know. Anyways, <laughs> it's like late at night and um, I finished editing the video that I want to post tomorrow and I'm really excited about it. Like, um, I think it perfectly came together, I think. Like, you know, I'm, I'm a perfectionist and I'm really hard on myself and like, there are certain things like if I could redo it all that I would do a little bit differently because of like the experience that I just saw how it all came together but I think it's good like I I'm happy with posting it and I hope you guys really like it because I worked really hard on this video but uh yeah I need to be awake in like six hours maybe because I have to take a shower because I gotta go to school in the morning for a little like Christmas party get together, even though it's like way past Christmas, um, for a get together with my other facilitators that I worked with this past semester. And a lot of them I worked with the year before too. So we're all really good friends and we're doing like little get together. That's about it. Oh, I had the tea tonight and it's not as good as Peach Tranquility. I'm a little bit disappointed. I looked it up on Tivana, like I compared Peach Tranquility versus Pre Precious White Peach, I think is the one that I got today. Good thing I didn't get a lot of it because um, like when I smelt it in the store, it smelled exactly the same. Uh, so I thought it would be pretty much the same, but I really like Peach Tranquility a lot better. I'm pretty p picky with my teas. I like things that are really fruity and sweet. So Peach Tranquility literally tastes like a fuzzy peach, but like warm and nice in a tea. So. I highly recommend that you try it if you have not already from Tivana. Oh, just yawned. That's a signal that I need to go to sleep. But anyways, I looked it up on the website to like compare the notes of the two teas. And they're very, very similar. Um, the Precious White Tea is obviously a white tea. And it doesn't really taste the same. And I was reading reviews on it and a lot of people... There were some people that really, really liked it. And then there were some people that didn't at all. That were like saying, this is the worst tea I've ever had. Which, I wish I read that before I bought it, but <laughs> it's good to like make my own opinion too. Like, it's not bad. I'd like it. I'm going to continue to drink it, but I just need to go and repurchase Peach Tranquility. Um, but yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed this random vlog, and I will see you guys later. Bye!